Okay, just got off the train here in Zwolle. Nice brisk morning. What is it, November 13th? <laughs> I'm not sure who that is, but there you go. Rolling through a rainbow, nice. Okay, it's an early chilly morning on a Sunday. And I just arrived in Zawala to see some kind of modern architecture here. Swing around, do a U-turn, show you this little plaza area just off from where the uh, main train station is. Got some nice light on it. Again, kind of a modern, you can see the train station in the background there. Kind of a modern landscape. Tried to soften it up with some uh, greenery in the middle there. Again, pretty lifeless at this point. These look like office buildings. And again, this is an early morning on a Sunday. Not that early. It's after 10. 10 20. You can see the clock there. But, uh, okay, let's go see if we can find what else Zwali's all about. <laughs> really haven't seen very many cars whatsoever. Zwali sports a very, very high bicycle mode usage. So, oh, here's a motor vehicle right here. Coming out of residential apartment areas over here. And I'm headed to the downtown area. See if I can track down some breakfast before truly exploring. And a steady stream of people riding bikes right up here. I do believe this is my turn and the direction I need to go. So, well, let's follow these guys. Nice little mural in this underpass area here. The lower level there, you'll see motor vehicle space. Very nicely done. Very comfortable environment. and rolling into what looks to be part of the historic area of the city on a feet strut. Nice traffic calmed street and as you can see quite comfortable for all ages and abilities. Nice housing stock here some one story two story three story certainly not ostentatious at all just 
nice comfortable housing there's a little church here a little shout out to the pedaling pastor again why churches need to have so much parking it's quite frustrating he talks about that a lot in his book This beautiful canal scene there, heading into the truly historic core. Again, the canal along that area there that we just went over. That would have been one of those canals that are in the classic star design that so many historic Dutch cities were designed with part of the uh, as I understand it the defense mechanism for the uh, for the city how they were able to defend the settlement as you can see here we're into a much older housing stock here And on a newer feet strut, and once again, see that uh, super comfortable environment for all ages and abilities. Truly beautiful buildings. And it looks like we have another church, and this church, far more bike parking than car parking. Love to see public institutions, cultural institutions have lots of bike parking. And along another part of the canal system, this little drawbridge here. Alright. And we can see a little pedestrian zone. We've got a retractable bollard here pretty much nothing is open on this early morning hopefully I can find something open for breakfast but on a Sunday it's not unusual for uh, places to stay closed until as late as 11 a.m. So, we shall see. It's not like being at home where you can be guaranteed to get a Starbucks coffee at 5 a.m.
definitely people out and about. But I've yet to find a single establishment that's actually open. But that could be about to change. We shall see. All right, getting into pulling into one of the historic cultural areas. One of the squares by the old church. Place looks like it's open but honestly it looks like a bar that never closed <laughs> I suppose that's possible there we go back work is open And I'm just going to roll on to this little plaza here. Nice little area. Near the water. Looks like there's some fishing. That place looks like it might be open. Looks like a wonderful place for a morning breakfast. Get a beautiful view of this canal, looking into the future, <laughs> looking into the distance there. I guess you could call that the future, if I'm riding that way. Again, Another mobility scooter. When you build all ages and abilities networks for bikes, you are building mobility options for people in mobility devices such as that, as well as that cool delivery vehicle right there. It's pretty awesome. Alright, well, let us go get some breakfast at this delightful place. I don't mind if I do. Oh, and that is a movie theater. Very nice. Cool. Let's go have some breakfast. And again, sending a huge thank you out to all my Active Towns ambassadors supporting the channel on Patreon, Buy Me A Coffee, YouTube Super Thanks, as well as making contributions to the nonprofit and purchasing things from the Active Towns store. Every little bit adds up and it's much appreciated. Thank you all so much.